You know a dream is like a river Ever changing as it flows And the dreamer's just a vessel That must follow where it goes Trying to learn from what's behind you And never knowing what's in store Makes each day a constant battle Just to stay between the shores Okay, my magical moment would be moments, and it's kind of general, uh, but I've loved all the times that we have spent a lot of time or gotten together as a service council. Um, from starting, you know, rocking our ranch, or even hiking the Y, though I just love getting together and spending more time. Hi, I'm Alex. I'm on the service council. My favorite memories are my 36 hour day, going to the Logan trip, and one of my favorite things about Service Council has been the working one-on-one, -on -one, um, especially with like uh, Joey and Alex and the stewardships that they would have with me. Um, I just really got to know them and, and I felt like I grew so much spiritually as a result of that and, and I'm really grateful for their example um, and the opportunity I had to get to know them. Okay, service Council this year has just been, it's been amazing. I think my favorite part has just been getting to know everybody on the council and just getting to, just realizing how much I love everybody around me and love the service that we're doing here. It's, it's been amazing. Um, one of my favorite experiences on uh, the service council this year has definitely been just building friendships and especially, I don't know, I feel like a lot of times people always comment um, how us girls, we always segregate, whatever, but I think we've, we just have really, really strong friendships and I'm grateful for that and just how close we've been able to come in just a year. Um, these are friendships that are going to last forever to learn and to grow in ways that I never even thought possible. I just say in my, my experience this year has just been, I feel like I've grown so much closer to my Savior. And I feel like through service, I've kind of figured out who I want to be and who I am. And um, a lot of like the direction the Lord wants me to go, or the way He wants me to go. I don't know what I would, could have done, or what I would have done this year without all the friendships that I've gained. I've had a lot of like, hard times and stresses and trials that seem to be coming to my life and I wouldn't have been able to do it without all these people in my life so so grateful for that. I love service council because of the friends I made and because everyone on council is awesome. I love the new meaning that service um, became in my life. So one of the things that I got from being on service council was being able to see the examples of the other council members. And Jesus Christ taught his disciples that let him that is great among you we are trying to incorporate that as well in my life. Um, my highlight this year has probably been just the sense of camaraderie that we all have. I love being able to just come in the center and just have um, my fellow brothers and sisters be there saying hello, clapping me in. Um, it's just been so fun to have that and I've loved every minute of it. Winter and fall retreats were a big highlight for me um, just because I really got to not only work with the council but work with the, the program directors and really intermingle with them and get to know them and so that was a special time uh, when we were able to uh, just have fun and, and develop those strong relationships with them that made a huge difference throughout the whole year. To come in throughout the semester, I know I always had somebody to talk to when we did. Well, we tried to have weekly devos. I wasn't very diligent about those, but Casey was always good about reminding me to come in, and he always had a thought or a story or a poem or a talk or something ready to kind of just uplift me. And some of my favorite moments were kind of spent in here talking to Casey just about my programs or about my life. Um, and Lauren and Joe, another member of the service council, we all kind of found ourselves in here a lot, kind of talking together, and it was a great way to bond with each other. And to utilize the resource that we have in KC. Like the times that I grew the most this year were times when like I was going through hard things but I was able to come in and talk with KC and have him like to bounce ideas off of and he was just always really uplifting and always gave great advice and direction of where to go and just always reminded me how great I was and the things that I was capable of. Highlight of this last year would definitely be getting to know all the service council members. Uh, just like it's incredible to be surrounded by such amazing people. Definitely, just the relationships that I get to walk through is the most special thing about this year. I think my favorite part of being on service council is just being surrounded by incredible people. Because everybody is so busy and so involved in different things, but still are able to have like meaningful relationships and talk to you and ask how you are, um, and are just so positive all the time. Sky, I'll never reach my destination. 
If I never try, so I will sail my vessel till the river runs dry. There's bound to be rough waters, and I know I'll take some falls. But with the good Lord as my captain, I can make it through them all. Yes, I will sail.